Then step two, we have to do create a Cucumber Maven project and update the form.xml file with below dependencies. All these dependencies we have to include in our form.xml file. Okay, so let's go and uh, no, do that. Create. So, how to create a Maven project? File, new. So, you can see other. Go to other. Other. So, search for Maven. You can see here if, if, if it is visible, you don't need to search. Otherwise, you just search Maven. So, search here Maven and you can see select the Maven project and click on next button and see this checkbox and click on next button. So enter here artifact ID, group ID and artifact ID, both you need to enter. So I'm entering, so BD Cucumber framework. So August 2nd, 2022. The same thing I'm giving here artifact ideas. So click on finish. You don't need to change anything. Just group ID, artifact ID you give. So artifact ID can give different you know, issues. Okay. So, but I'm giving same. So click on finish. See? BD Cucumber framework is creating. You can see here it is done. Now you go and you can see the structure, complete structure. You can see. So that's complete structure. You can see form.xml, GRE, and SRC test resources, SRC test Java, SRC main resources, SRC main Java, all the folder structure you are getting. Right? So this is the next thing you need to do that. Now, so open the form.xml, we'll include all the dependencies. Let's include all the dependencies. So just to add, otherwise you can go here. You can go here and I have given everything here. So everything cut, copy, paste from properties to till end, all the dependencies, you can add it. You don't need to do anything, just to copy paste this till here, okay? So copy paste. That's it. You don't need to do any other thing also. Just do copy paste. Do control yes. After pasting, do a control yes. Control S, yes, you do. See what are all the things I am adding here. Let me show you. This I don't need. I'll just remove this. what are all the things we added here the dependencies can you see here dependencies first cucumber java cucumber jnit cucumber core so these are the three very very important things cucumber java cucumber jnit cucumber core and then i'm adding selenium org dot open Selenium HQ dot Selenium, Selenium hyphen Java. So this is the group ID. In this group, there are many, right? Many artifacts. Java, Selenium is there, Ruby, Selenium is there, Python, Selenium is there, JavaScript, Selenium is there, C sharp, Selenium is there. That's artifact, means artifact means individual software. So group means umbrella. So that's the this group ID artifacted and version. So then we have a so, Boni Garcia, so this web driver manager to manage our exe file concepts. You don't need to download the exe files. That's the main uh, advantage, right? That is the one thing. And uh, I'm using JNIT, JNIT Jupyter API, the latest so JNIT 5 I'm using here to do all my things. Even you can add a Gherkin also, Gherkin, so to add the, so Gherkin steps. And this is for Cucumber reporting. We are using a 5.7.0 and Cucumber HTML for HTML reports you can use. And Covertula, this is for the you know, uh, code coverage purpose, Covertula. So Hamcrest for the Hamcrest uh, you know, uh, matchers. 
if you want to use matches, you can use uh, ham crystal, ham crystal. So that's uh, this ham test related. So dependencies after. So we have a, you can see dependencies after. We have a build section, right? We have build sections, the build section here. So the build section, you have a lot of, you know, uh, Surefire plugin reports and Maven compiler plugin reports, all these are available in the build section. Then property section, so these are the different sections in the form.xml. So if you see errors, okay, if you are you're seeing errors, right? So it is throwing errors. So what you can do to remove these errors, select the project, right click, Maven update project. You do update project, force update you do, force update, click OK. Mostly it will solve that uh, issues. If not solved, we'll see that, okay? So, so this is the one, uh, it is throwing this error. Okay, so it is asking missing, uh, no. So this uh, tool, this security thing, it is missing, it is saying, but this one. So this, but I don't have, I have to include this. Tool start jar file, I need to download, I have to give this. Tools start jar. So let me show you I, whether I have a tool start jar in my JDK path. So program files, um, Java, so JDK and uh, lib and security. So the tools is not the tools dot jar we need. So that we need to provide that. So I will will download that uh, security tools dot jar file. Okay. So that I think I have provided here full start jar file from where you can download. I think I have downloaded in the bottom side. Let me give you that. So, so we got uh, some solution. So we have to download the so for above problem, we are getting some solution here. You have to download the security file. So this error, I have given the solution here. So you're getting this error, no such method error. And uh, if you're getting this, and uh, we have to download this tools. So they're, they're giving very clearly here how to solve that. So then you have to add a tools uh, and uh, this one. So you have to remove this gova.com. Uh, we, we are not placing that gova any phone, but they are asking to download the, um, there is one more concept, uh, tools.jar file you have to download. So I'm just, uh, let's download that. Somewhere it is there. That also important. Let's issue. And, uh, Okay, so I'll restart my clips. 
Anyways, sometimes restart also will help you. Uh, restarting the system or anything, it will help you. Still, it is there. But, uh, for recording. So, to change this uh, GRE, you have to select that GRE, uh, Java GRE system library, go to build path, configure build path, and double click on this GRE system library. Under libraries tab, select the alternate GRE. See, if you have a JDK, that's fine. If you don't have, so then what you need to do, click on install GREs. So click on add, so standard uh, VM and go to this uh, GRE home directory, click on directory. So here I need to provide my JDK. So program files, Java, JDK. So this I'm going to give that, that's it. But see, I got the JDK. So finish, so I'll select my JDK 11. So select the JDK 11, apply, apply and close. Now you can see here JDK 11. Select the JDK 11, finish it. So apply, apply and close it. So close this and I'll going to update my Java project. So this should uh, clear our errors. Because we are not JDK 8, there is a security tools we need. But here, I don't think so we need the tools if need. So we'll do that. So let me do restart. Still not resolving. Still not resolving. Security missing artifact com dot sun dot tool start jar. Here I have to give sources uh, why this is again the build path configure build path. So jar. Okay, so that's fine. So we'll see that while running. If you get an issue, I'll see. But uh, no, there we can go and set this push.jar file for Java 11. So here you can find seven artifacts, top artifacts, but where is the file? Okay. I don't have anything like this. What are you asking? Um, I 
שופטים. Somewhere I kept it. Um, okay. Let me stop this. That I'll uh, so we'll start writing the code tomorrow. Please finish the no uh, 